this is the part where we come to rule 2. You may not change any value of your appearance, which is head, eyes, and mouth. Because these values are used for the position of the eyes, your head, and the jaw. What I meant, if you change any of these values, this will happen. Your, in this case, your eyes will... Uh, it only works for some sliders. Yeah. Your eyes will uh, yeah, not fit it anymore. So, rule 2 never ever change the values of the head, eyes, and the mouth while wearing a prim furry hat with moving prim eyes. Now, um, just as I mentioned at the beginning, the shape of the tiger is pretty big. Um, and you probably want to use the shape of one of your older avatars, which is smaller or, um, or thinner or bigger, whatever. Um, the easiest way to do this, because, you know, if you, um, if you wear the shape of your older avatar, it will have the head, eye and mouth values of your older avatar and not the necessary values of the tiger avatar. So all you need to do is put the tiger's original shape on, go to the head, eyes, uh, in this case uh, head and eyes will be enough, um, you need to write down all of those values. Like here, 14, 0, 46, 43, all of them. Same for the eyes. And then put your old shape on, or the shape you want to use for the new avatar, and fill in or replace the um, values you, ju you, ju you just have written down. Um, one last thing. The whiskers of this avatar, just a second, are too small to be shrinked down. Um, there is a little trick you can do with those. First of all, I would um, position them a little higher in this case. Yeah, but you will notice they're not inside the muzzle. You can change that by going into the building tool, choose edit linked again, and move every whisker into the muzzle. This will probably need a lot of work and time.
Okay, um, I hope this tutorial was helpful for you. And like I said, it's not just for the KZK Tiger, it's for all avatars who uses Prim Eyes. Thanks for listening, and I hope it was a little help for you. Bye!